Hola la familia, it is your girl Lola J y'all and I am back on the scene with another banger. Yes y'all, I am back. Um, so, we just go ahead and get into it because I know, I know, I know, like y'all was like, what happened? Okay. Okay, I wake up in slay. Yeah, I know I dress bummy comfy every day, but hey, hey, that's just me. I'm really Lola J. Um, excuse me, are you really Lola J? Yes, of course, it's me. I'm really Lola J. So, let's address, um, when we got, so obviously y'all, in the video, I just dropped the she and hole. Um, I know I was supposed to drop that before we went to Tampa. I get it. But, um, basically, y'all, uh, when we went to Tampa, I told you I didn't go to sleep that whole night. So, then we got there, and I didn't really go to sleep on the plane. Um, so I didn't go to sleep on the plane. But let's rewind first, because that I'm, I'm missing a whole big story. So, we get, y'all, to um, the airport. Mind you, y'all, like, our plane left at 7-something a.m. And I told y'all, like, you know, obviously, we was trying to get there early. So, we got to the airport, y'all, I think, like, maybe, like, 4.45, 5 or something like that. Because, you know, Atlanta Airport be tripping. So... We got there early, and um, I'm, like, joking with everybody, as I do all the time. I'm, like, everybody has, like, their keys. Everybody got their IDs. And, like, I'm just, like, laughing or whatever. And so my mom was, like, yeah. Sister was, like, looking at everybody. And then, like, I'm looking at her while she's looking at us. And I'm just like, no. <laughs> Y'all, she left all of her stuff, her license, her freaking cards, all of that at her house. Mind you, she does not live a hop and a skip away from the airport, y'all. She lives in Gwinnett County, so yeah, like... Yeah. So anyways, so that was a like that was the it. So basically y'all, like that didn't stop our trip though, because if y'all follow me on IG at really Lola J, obviously you guys know that at some point we made it to Tampa. So we ended up having to book with Southwest, um, because they had another flight leaving that day. Thank you, Southwest, you the GOAT. Um, so basically we bought those tickets and then we, um, yeah, so we got those tickets and we had to obviously go back to go get her license and everything, um, and like her wallet basically. So we did that. So then mind you, y'all, I have not gone to sleep cause I was just doing a she and ho with y'all. And then, like, I literally finished packing, did my lashes. I finally got the lashes right, y'all. I'm so proud of me. Like, YouTube University, check in. I want my diploma because, y'all, I finally got these lashes right. So, anyways, so, yeah. So, um, so we literally, y'all, we drove back, got her stuff, and then at that point, it was time to go back to the airport anyway. So we went back to the airport and we basically got everything um, and was able to like, I think we didn't get there y'all until like noon, which mind you, we we're supposed to get there at 8.30. So, um, so yeah, so it was, it was a lot, but again, like I said, y'all, I have not slept. So, I was running off of fumes at this point, y'all. Your girl was tired. Like, I was through. 
but um we ended up like i think like i posted something and then i was like oh i'm just gonna edit the video or whatever because it was just a she in hole at that point so and then i also couldn't remember if i closed the video out or not but thankfully i did he grows a goat but so yeah so then y'all um we was just like in tampa and like i think yeah my niece um ended up getting sick and it was just more so like just a change of environment type of you know sickness then like you know like we all started to get like the sniffles except for my sister and so one night y'all like it wasn't it wasn't the night it was like i was supposed to edit the video then i like got i don't know like i went to a workout and i was like i was tired y'all like i just, i needed to sleep so that's probably also why what i'm about to tell y'all what happened because i didn't have i wasn't rested at like resting at all like i needed to sleep so i was real tired but then i did get up and go work out so that was cool and i just didn't have no energy but we was just running around doing like a whole bunch of stuff y'all and then obviously me and my mom we've been to tampa but we wanted to show my sister like tampa so we did that y'all and it was lit like she loves it so we all moving down there period um but yeah so anyways so then like a couple nights later y'all like this like it kicked in like my body was just like girl what's up what's going on because basically what happened y'all is um it was like in the middle of the night like i just got like soup like i just could not stop shaking like i was just so cold like i was just like what is i ain't never been that cold like ever so i was just shaking so like i usually don't sleep with anything on like that but i had to put a sweatshirt on i had to put socks on i hate sleeping with socks on i had to put socks on y'all like i was about like if i had sweatpants i would put those on too that's how cold i was like i was just so cold and i was just like what is going on so then my mom had gave me some tylenol so when she gave me the tylenol or whatever like i was just like okay cool like i started to like stop shivering like i was like my teeth was like chattering i think that's how you say it <laughs> but i was i was doing like that y'all i was so cold so then I get up and like, I don't know, it was like, no, I went back to sleep and it was like two hours later, y'all, I was hot. Like, it was like my whole body was burning, y'all. Like, I swear, it was, it was crazy. Like, I was just so hot, y'all. Like, it was ridiculous. So, so then after that, y'all, like, I was just drained of energy and like, we wanted to take my niece and nephew, my other niece and nephew, um, to the zoo. So we did that, y'all. And I was I was on the struggle bus, I ain't gonna lie. But all in all, though, after all of that, like, I basically had a really good time in Tampa, as per usual. But next time, y'all, which would be in what september or august yeah august when we go i am gonna get sleep i am not gonna be filming no videos the night before <laughs> doing a she and haul for y'all like i'm gonna have this video filmed i should have had it filmed y'all because like i i probably really should have went to sleep and i would have been fine like i probably wouldn't have gotten sick or anything so that's why y'all didn't get nothing from me from Tampa. And that's just that on that. Because your world was not feeling good at all. And then we just had a, a lot of other circumstances that happened. But anyways, y'all. Yes. So back. Let's get back into it, y'all. Like, basically, I was like, I need to put out this video. And I just been like, I just been mad busy. Like, I, I don't understand y'all. I don't know if it's just me. Or if it's just like everybody feel this way. But why I feel like the days like I look up and it's like six o'clock. And I'm like, where did the day go? <laughs> I just got up two hours ago. Like, I just really feel like that, y'all. Like, I just do not understand. Like, every single time I try to be like, okay, this is what I need to do today. Da, 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 da. And then all of a sudden it's like, dang. Like, I only was able to do X, Y, and Z. So, I don't know if I need to start waking up at 3 a.m. 
to accomplish the things in my day. But I will say though, y'all, like my goal, no matter what, is make sure I work out. Like that's, but, and I've been, I've been getting it done, y'all. I've really been getting it done. Like I'm gonna show y'all a couple clips of like, you know what I've been doing. Like I've been working, <laughs> but anyways, no, for real though. So um today y'all so since everybody is doing it i guess i'll partake in the activities oh um, because you know your girl she loves some drinks now so um i guess the little moonshine thing like the fruit stuff and like it's like a pickle moonshine all of that all of that that people are tasting I am going to go try to find it and we are going to do a tasting um look y'all like I like I like some alcohol and moonshine is good too but like I don't is it moonshine I really don't even know to be honest like I really don't even know but but yeah so I am about to go do that y'all so I'm gonna take y'all with me I'm not gonna take my camera because it's about to die per usual right <laughs> so i'm not gonna take my camera but i am gonna film like the process when i go to um the liquor store the liquor store and yeah and we about to about to get in y'all like my hair though like it's given it it's given like i was very nervous and scared and usually y'all you know long hair don't care but it's actually more shorter than I actually like but I actually wanted it like shorter but because I saw this one picture I'll put her over here but it couldn't happen like that because I couldn't find the short hair but anyways so yeah it's given and I love the colors so yeah it's a lot y'all but uh while we take this quick intermission I am going to show y'all what I've been doing in the gym period let's get it All right, y'all know that I had to go ahead and stop it right there. Your girl did not want to get copywritten, but y'all like money bag, yo, sad playtime over. It's the big leagues. Let's get it, y'all. Make sure you guys head over to my IG at tough fit it y'all listen like i have workout videos over there y'all i'm building a fitness community y'all we getting it like for real for real so make sure oh that girl got abs like make sure y'all go ahead and check me out because look we getting it here i was struggling a little bit right there but i got it together so anyways y'all yes make sure you guys check me out make sure you guys you know comment on any workouts that you guys try of mine and yes so we just gonna get back into this uh you know this vlog this moonshine while we over here being healthy you know we got to get a little moonshine in our system too y'all all right look at these squats yeah hola la familia i hope y'all enjoyed the workout videos your girl been getting it in period um so for those in the back who want to know um <laughs> I have been, I forgot to tell y'all, I took a food sensitivity test um, by Everlywell, I think that's what it's called. Um, y'all know I'll be messing up people's names and stuff. <laughs> so I should probably go and look first. But anyways, yeah, so I think that's what it's called, y'all. And so I took one of them tests or whatever, and it basically, you know, it basically showed you what you were... Um, what type of food sensitivity ugh, food sensitivity you have for like over 200 foods so y'all that test told me something period because look first of all i already don't like chicken so that was just check mark so uh, apparently i have a food sensitivity to chicken don't even like it anyway so i'm good with that but y'all they broke my heart broke my heart y'all i cried i ain't cried but i was upset so i have a food sensitivity to wheat do y'all know how much stuff like is made with wheat like this is crazy so i was really upset that i had a food sensitivity wheat because honestly y'all i really think it's like all of the tortillas that i eat it's <laughs> like the flour tortillas yeah, like I can, I can eat, I will kill some tacos. 
tacos, chimichanga, burrito, like, I mean, come on. So, so yeah, so it's like a lot of stuff on there or whatever. Not a lot of stuff, but basically, you know, there's like, I don't know, like a top five or whatever. Top five, top five. And it's like five. what you're most like sensitive to and you're supposed to eliminate those out of your diet. So that's what I've been doing, y'all. And I will say that I you, your girl gets, she still gets a little sleepy, but um, me not having like wheat and like, I don't really eat vanilla like that, but I chicken was really high, but me not having wheat, y'all, because like, when I have wheat or a lot of carbs, y'all, I get tired. Like, I get so tired. So, I have not had any wheat. And your girl's just been a ball of energy. Like, that's just what we doing. So, yeah. So, I recommend you guys, if you have not taken that test, I do recommend you taking that test at least once just to see what you are sensitive to, y'all. Like, there's nothing wrong with that. But since we over here on the healthy stuff, <laughs> actually, we need to get off of this healthy stuff, y'all. And because we about to tap into some stuff. So I did not record going into the liquor store, y'all, because we was literally, we walked in and I was going to record like, like obviously going to find it. But right when we walked in, y'all, like it was right there. Like I didn't even have to look for it. My mom was like, it's right there. And I was like, okay. Wow. <laughs> so, so yeah, right when we walked in, it was right there. We was literally in the liquor store for like 2.5 seconds. So y'all would have had 2.5 seconds of me saying, oh, wow, it's right there. So yeah, but I will share with y'all the flavors that I got and we about to do this testing y'all. I actually don't have everything I need. First of all, while we, while I'm opening this up, y'all, um, I'm trying to get rid of this table that I got right here and like... The reason why, y'all, is because the table and the chairs need to go. Because I literally, y'all, like, I acted like, first of all, I just didn't, I just, I wasn't thinking. That's clear. I really wasn't thinking. So, I got this table, y'all, and it's real cute. Real cute. But, but, the chairs that I also bought with the table, y'all, like, I don't know what I thought, but... This monkey I got sitting on my back can't sit in these chairs. Like, I'm telling y'all, like, these chairs is too small. It ain't made. It ain't made for thicker than a snicker. It ain't even made for snickers. Like, this, these, this chair is, like, these chairs are just way too small. But I actually really don't even need it because I actually don't even sit here. Like, I could just, like, get away, like, get away, like, move it out or whatever and then i bought like this super huge whiteboard and i could just put the whiteboard against the wall and we good because i actually never 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 sit here but anyways so y'all since everybody is doing this i you know your girl likes some liquor and i always like i love like i wouldn't say that i'm a I think like in college or whatever, obviously your girl drunk anything in a bottle or a can. I still kind of do clearly, but I feel like now I kind of like, you know, a little mature type of type of liquor. You know what I'm saying? Like, like, let me get, let me get a, uh, what did I have the other day? It was an old fashioned espresso. <laughs> it's fancy, right? Y'all. It was so good. Actually, I got it at Yard House. So if y'all go to Yard House, get their old fashioned espresso, y'all. It was bomb. But yeah, like I like fancy stuff now. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like sangrias and stuff. I don't know if that's fancy, but it's fancy to me. But anyways, so I don't know. Everything every single time I think about it, thinking like drinking baka takes me back to college, y'all. Like oof. It's like, it's crazy. Like, in the kind of vodka. It's not like, first of all, we college students, so we can't afford nothing. <laughs> like, people pitching in $5 to get a $20 bottle of vodka. That's sad. Anyways, um, yeah. So, this one, y'all, is the peaches one. So, I actually heard this one was the best kind. So, we have this moonshine. Um... Mm -hmm. 
I'm excited about this one. It's a butter pecan um, moonshine. So I think I actually like, I actually uh, need some cups too. So yeah. But so basically, y'all, um, I was going to do this video the other day, but I couldn't do it because they wasn't like, I felt like people like been doing these or whatever and it hasn't been cold like i feel like it's gonna be so nasty if it's not cold so i ain't that tough now um okay then i heard this one was good too the banana pudding cream moonshine yeah y'all it's gonna be it's gonna be fire but you know i had to do it for the people in the back i had to get the pickles y'all like I don't know why I did this to myself because I like pickles, but I don't want this to ruin my pickle taste because sure enough, I'm going to be mad if <laughs> I don't know why I'm tapping this like this, but I'm going to be mad. Um, and I'm going to be mad if it tastes good, too, because ain't no way some pickles should be in no vodka, y'all, period. But let me get some cups, y'all. Let me get some cups. We can do a little taste test. You know what I'm saying? Who little booty going to fit on this chair? My butt ain't even that big, don't make no sense. Okay, what we wanna start with first. I'ma actually, y'all, I'ma start with like the butter pecan and banana pudding first. I gotta I gotta say that pickle stuff for last. I can't do that. It, it's just not gonna happen. But y'all, so I got my car detailed for the first time in like ever. <laughs> so, like I've gotten car washes and stuff like that, but I've never like really gotten any detail. And like, you know, I cleaned out the inside myself or whatever. But this time, like, like I said, I got a detail, y'all. Tell me why them people's clean out my car. And obviously they throw like trash away and stuff like that. So they was throwing trash away. We'll do this, that, and the third. I get in the car and I look down. Y'all tell me why I had some lashes in my car and they put them on like my center, uh, like my middle console. Why, why they do that to me? Why? <sighs> so I was like, okay, girl, thank you. I don't know, should this have, should I have shaken this first? Y'all, we about to get lit. Huh. Because listen, we about to be in here Turn on some uh, Megan Thee Stallion. Ooh, that's probably a little bit too much. See, now I'm gonna have to drink all of this before I drink the banana pudding. I had a heavy hand when I pour y'all. Like, I remember one time I made jello shots for the people in the back, and y'all, them jello shots wasn't nothing to play with. When I tell you, like, probably one jello shot got everybody drunk, that's how heavy my hand was. But okay, y'all. Y'all, don't mind me right here. I really thought I heard somebody tugging at my door and okay. I was about to fight. Period. You ready to taste yeah, this? Yeah, okay, continue with the video. Okay. It's given. And you know what, y'all? I'm pretty sure this got milk in it. So, for y'all, for y'all, I'm messing up my veganism. Um, yeah. Because, listen, this tastes like. Like, I don't, I don't know. How can I phrase this? Yeah, it definitely got milk and cream in it. But that's okay. One day. Just one day. Um, So, this tastes like... um, Let me see. Hmm, how can I describe this? So, y'all ever had Bailey's? Uh, it tastes like Bailey's. Very much given Bailey's and ice cream put together. Um, I hope this don't tear my stomach out. I hope this don't tear my stomach up because I said I hope this don't tear my stomach out. <laughs> Did it get to me already? <laughs> I'm just playing. Yeah, because listen, it's good, but it's just like I have vodka in a minute. So either I'm be on this couch sleep or... I'm going to be texting somebody like, what's up, babe? <laughs> Y'all, mm -mm, I ain't texting nobody. We're going to be on this couch sleep because I feel like alcohol gets you in trouble all the time. Like, all the time, alcohol gets you in trouble. Like, 
Because I really like sometimes, like especially like I know I do. If you don't do this, then whatever. Stay in the back. Um, but I feel like when you done, you know, a little inebriated, a little inebriated, like you do be like reminiscing. Like, especially if you're single. Yeah. You be reminiscing for sure. On like old stuff. But then I be thinking about new stuff, y'all. Like, dang. I wonder what me and my husband about to be doing. Like, that's what I that's what I be doing, y'all. I don't know about y'all, but that's what I be doing. So I'm gonna finish this because yeah, because I poured too much in here and I think actually I'm gonna take taste the peaches next, y'all. Cause I don't like I don't like sweet stuff like that. I don't I don't know about y'all, but I don't like sweet stuff. Like it's not my thing. Like I don't know, like lately, honestly, I've been kind of having like this little chocolate thing. Um, but I really don't like since I was little, I did not fuck with sweet stuff. Like, it's just I don't know, it's just never been my thing. I don't know why. But I do I did love like bowl of cereal and stuff like that. But I'm talking about like candy, like cake and stuff like that. Mm-mm. Like, I hate cake, like, frosting on a cake, unless it's German chocolate. But if you're going to make a German chocolate cake, do not put chocolate on the frosting. Like, just let it be that coconut, pecan thing. thing. Don't, don't put, like, I've seen people put, like, a layer of chocolate. I wanted to fight them every time. Every time. But, but, yeah. Also, today, y'all... I went and got um got my oil change. C C C C. I like what what I did today because I probably should like obviously I should have recorded it, but I didn't think it was gonna be given the way it, it really gave today. Like I first of all, I really got a whole bunch of stuff done today. Like I'm so proud of myself. Pat myself on the back because I got so much stuff done today. But the oil change job. Uh, so basically i pulled up or whatever and like you know typically the oil changes you get them the keys you get out the car you go sit in a little lobby waiting room or whatever this oil change place not like that they was so nice they was like you can stay in your car da, da, da. the only thing they don't check is brake fluid which is fine um so yeah so they did my oil change while i was sitting in the car y'all while I was sitting in the car. So I was like, yes, honey. Yes. Like, please. I Where have you been? Like, why have I been missing, like, this? Because I just feel like, for me, y'all, I just don't like giving somebody my keys and then <laughs> getting out the car. Just, I don't know if it's, like, a control thing. But I feel like, I don't know. I be thinking about, like, what if they, like, wreck my car like obviously if i'm at a dealership they're gonna give me a brand new car of course like but you gonna have to go through all of that red tape filing insurance claims and all of this that and the third but i was like wait like really like i'm serious what if they wreck my car and like are they just gonna give me the value of my car and i'm gonna have to go like i'm just like i'd be wondering that like what if like something happened and like, I be thinking, because, you know, they lift your um your thing up, right? They lift it all the way up in the air. So, I was like, what if something happened? My car just fall off the little, little thing. And, <laughs> like, that's what I be thinking, y'all. That's how, that's how my mind, like, works. That's how my mind be thinking. Like, I be like, dog. Like, they really... They really uh could drop my car while it's all the way in the air. Like, or it could just slide off and just go like that. So, yeah. I be thinking that. But now that I think about it, how did they change my oil if it wasn't lifting the air? Because don't you got to, like, drip the oil? Y'all, what if I really didn't get no oil change today? What if they was like, what if this, like, whole business is a scam? But it was, it was mad people there. And I'm going to tell you, too, that it's legit. So I ain't even going for it. Like, or try to say something because it was legit. Um, the reason why is because the police came through or whatever. Not that they was getting an oil change, but they was getting a car wash. So 
I feel like if it the if the police assist can get a car wash, then the oil change legit. Too. So it was like a car wash oil change type of thing. You know, it was it was different. It was cute, but the reason why I did not want to go because the last time I went to um, the Jeep dealership, y'all, they tried it. They tried it. So I had got a new key fob, and she was like, "Oh well, I don't think this one's gonna work." And I was like, why is it not going to work? And she's like, because it's not the original one to go to your car. And so if we program it, it may not work. It may it may work. That key file worked just fine. But then also, for some reason, I don't know if this is like something that they do or whatever. But she had hooked up something to my car. And she had ended up like, I think I told y'all this. She had ended up like clearing all of my codes out. So... I went to go get an emissions test because it's my birthday and they were just like you're you failed emissions test because all your codes are cleared out whatever the fuck that means so <laughs> I'm like all right cool well what am I supposed to do and they was like well you need to drive your car for 70 miles I think I told y'all this and I was just like absolutely not but I did it anyway and yeah so i just and then they didn't even give me no sticker last time y'all like i just wasn't fucking with them like i'm gonna have to go to find another jeep dealership probably like honestly when i move to tampa because like they probably got better deep, deep jeep dealerships down there so yeah y'all this may be hitting me already because i'm just over here talking to y'all just we over here having a whole little kiki um and i ain't even drug nothing but okay, so let me finish this. Whew. That's good, y'all. Like, if it was cold outside, that's it. All right, y'all, we're gonna try these peaches. I'm scared. I was not gonna get a spoon either, because I was like, I am not gonna sit here and get no spoon in these peaches, y'all. Sucking up all of this, um, all of this vodka in here. All right, y'all, pray for me. Oh my goodness. See, maybe I was supposed to, <laughs> maybe I'm not supposed to eat this, y'all. <laughs> I might be a little inebriated already. I'm just playing. Okay. no peach in that that was just pure vodka it wasn't no peach in that y'all you know when your insides start burning that's what happened my insides is burnt it's good it's good but who said this was the best one because this is just straight alcohol straight alcohol let me taste one more. Just like, I'm going to get a small one this time. Because that was a big one. Let me let me taste one more. I don't want to do it. Because I'm still like, it's, a, it's in the back of my throat, y'all. Like, it's in the back. Whew. Ooh, wee. Okay. Y'all can tell I ain't drinking in a minute. Because I'm acting. Like, I'm really acting. All right, one time for the people in the bag. That one was a little better. When alcohol make you like, make that face, we need to talk. I lied, that one was not better. Put it away. Oh Jesus. I need the other one. The other one was sweet. It was nice to me. That one wasn't nice. It is not talking nice to me at all. We gonna try this banana pudding one, y'all. Because I, I can't. Like what? Like my girl Peyton said, I can't take it. <laughs> oh, I should have. Ooh. 
This smell good, y'all. Smell like banana pudding is what it do. All right, this probably got milk in it too, huh? Shall do. It's okay because um I'm really not even gonna be drinking these. I like I'm gonna mess with the peaches, y'all, but I need to make like a peach daiquiri or something with it, cause cause uh that like if you eat like four peaches, you on the floor that's that's how strong that is like you eat four peaches and you on the floor you eat three and you texting your ex talking about you remember when yeah very much so because that's what that's given it is like i just oof vodka just do something different to me you know what i'm saying it's not it's not like other alcohol like it's something in vodka that just make you go zero to 100 and then go straight to a thousand like it ain't <sighs> vodka ain't nothing to play with y'all i said don't play with me play with your mammy okay <laughs> let me get together all right so this is the banana pudding right yeah banana pudding Okay, because you know what it tastes like. It don't taste like banana pudding like that. It tastes like the banana flavor now and later. Um, Y'all remember them now and later. After I just said I didn't eat candy. But I really didn't eat candy like that. But um, everybody know what a banana flavor now and later tastes like. Um, but yeah, that's what it tastes like. Um, yeah, it's giving very much now and later banana flavor. But I guess it do kind of taste like a banana pudding. But it's more so it tastes like that. So it's good. Like, I will mess with it. I probably, honestly, y'all, like, I would probably want to make this with, like, oat milk, almond milk. I should do that. Look, y'all, don't steal my idea. I don't even know if I'm going to do the idea. But I'm going to contact Old Smokey Moonshine Company. And I'm going to be like, look, for the people that got dairy restrictions and sensitivities look i want to enjoy my night i don't want to be in the bathroom so can you please make a moonshine banana pudding and butter pecan with either oat milk or almond milk that's my request and if y'all could do that you got a customer you got a customer. So, we gonna see y'all. We gonna see. Now, if I'ma know something, if they come out with it in the next, like, month or two, I know they better cut me a check. I know that much. Period. <laughs> okay. Whew. Y'all, I'm scared to try these pickles because if these pickles is anything, because see this, this y'all, it's just like, it's just the, the cream. You know what I'm saying? This is like real peaches and some vodka. No preservatives because the vodka do everything. So I feel like these pickles going to be the same thing. And it's not like, you know, I could get a little small pickle. No, this is a whole pickle. Yeah, I'm about to be on this flow. I am about to be on this flow. And the thing is, after this, I told myself, because y'all, my body hurt. I don't know. Because I'm tired. Like, <laughs> that workout I did, yo. I felt it. I felt it all the way in my toes. Like, that's how bad it was. Um, but I told myself I was going to take a muscle bath. But with uh, the Pacha, um, the Pacha, uh, like, detox soaps. And they got, a like, a muscle detox type of thing or whatever. Like, I guess a, a soap balm, bath bomb that you just drop in there. And I wanted to see what it was hitting on. And... I want to do that tonight, but I'm going to go ahead and wash his face, get in the shower, and I'm going to lay on his couch. 
Because this is how this make me feeling. Because it's either I'm outside, like, begging the stallion, or I'm be on this couch sleep. It's no in-between. It ain't, oh, let me clean up, da -da -da, this, that, and the third. No. We either about to go to a bar, <laughs> or <laughs> I'm be on this couch. So, I I recommend being on this couch. <laughs> um, I'm stalling. I am stalling, y'all. I do not want to eat this pickle. Look at this. I don't want to eat this pickle. I don't. But it's like, it's like, it's, I just know, I know when I bite into this pickle, y'all, it's going to be something and I'm going to know something. <sighs> Why y'all talk me into doing this? Why? Knowing I do like alcohol, but not like this. This is crazy. See, <laughs> tart a little tart but that's what pickle is but it tastes better than peaches though definitely tastes better than peaches i can eat i can eat about four of these pickles and we'll see it only got 20 percent in here that's why that's why over here lying so these peaches is 65 proof it got 32.5 percent alcohol in it these pickles it's 40 proof, 20% alcohol in it. What's these? This is 35 proof, 17.5%. And this the same thing. So basically, yeah, we're going to move those to the side. Because obviously, if you want to sit here and, and be cute, and be snuggled up, then you can go ahead and get that butter pecan and that banana pudding. But if you want to be turned up with making these, you need to go ahead and get these peaches. Um, these pickles is just for like a Sunday afternoon, uh, um, a Saturday barbecue. This is what these pickles is for, in my opinion. But them peaches. Them peaches now will have you at the club saying your name is peaches. That's what them peaches will do. I didn't think I was going to like it. Although my face is not saying that I like it. But it ain't bad. It's really not. Now... Can I see myself just eating, sitting here eating pickles and vodka? No. <laughs> but I bought it, so will I? Yes. But I'm not going to mess with these butter pecan and banana pudding, y'all. I really just wanted to taste it, but the fact that it got milk in it, absolutely not. Like, I don't have a milk issue. Well, on this food sensitivity test, it said that I have an issue with cow's milk. But, like... I don't feel like I'm lactose intolerant. Like, I don't feel like when I eat, like, whole milk or something like that, that, like, like my stomach be hurting. It really, it don't at all. But uh, it took me a minute to get used to, but I actually don't even drink, like, any milk anymore. Like, my favorite is Almond Breeze banana milk. I tear it up. I will tear it up. So they can actually put that in there. Banana Breeze almond milk, you're welcome. Um, but yes, so I will, yeah, I'll tear that up, but, um, or I'll drink, um, the Simply Almond, uh, yeah, and then I also weirdly have a sensitivity to, uh, vanilla, so, yeah, strange, but, um, anywho, yeah, so, I probably won't actually, like, honestly, I'll probably just throw those out, but these peaches and these pickles, yeah, because I can see myself, like, just taking some pickles. Because I actually do like eating pickles. Um, I can see myself just taking pickles. And they'd be like, ooh, what you eating, pickles? I know what they. Y'all better not put one of this on the burger, though. Y'all put it on the burger. 
That's nasty. But. They'll be like, why are you eating pickles? Don't worry about it, sweetheart. Don't worry about it. But yeah. Actually, I don't want to finish that. I'm going to finish it. But I ain't going to eat no more pickles. Uh-uh. Because, look. Because, listen. I've been saying that, like, for the past couple weeks. And I say it to myself so often that I, like, I'm starting to say it, like, out loud. That sounded real crazy. <laughs> but I really be in my head. I be like, because, listen, what you not going to do? But, yeah. And I be like, what you not going to do is just sit here and not work out. But, yeah. Y'all, that, I don't know. I mean, they got other kind. They got some cherries. Um, I can't remember all that they had. But they got, like, straight moonshine. Um, like, it's flavored. I thought you could make moonshine. Like, I thought that was, like, against the law to make moonshine. I guess I'm wrong. But, yeah. Okay, so let me tell y'all all of them that they got. Oh, my God. That actual uh, pickle just hit different, though. I ain't even gonna lie. That last bite that I took, y'all, it's a little different. It's a little different. Um... Oof. All right, they got pineapples with pina colada. That's probably fire. Ooh, they actually have a hot and spicy uh pickle. I don't know about that. I can't mix that now. Be the bathroom for real. Um, they got a white chocolate strawberry cream. That sounds too much. That sounds like my stomach gonna be hurting. That sounds like I'm gonna be rocking back and forth and back and forth. Um. Let me see. We had the butter uh butter pecan. They got a mountain java sound coffee-ish. Um ooh, they got an apple pie. They got cherries. Not a blue flame. <laughs> yeah, y'all. Ooh, they got hunch punch. Um yeah, so they got like a whole bunch of like different types of flavors. I don't know if um like, all of these are in the store, but I guess... I don't know. Can you order from their website? You probably could, but, yeah. So, I mean, it was straight, y'all. Like, I mean, I give, like, the peaches, like, honestly, if you want a lit tip or whatever, and you really trying to get lit, like, yeah, I would do the peaches. Pickles, they are right. Like, I can't see myself eating them every single day, but... Like, they're pretty straight. The butter pecan and banana pudding is so good. But until they come out with a non-dairy one, I can't mess with it. It's over for me. But, yeah. So, y'all. We go. We gonna try some things tonight. Um, I did like this, though. Like, I love trying stuff, y'all. Y'all know me. Like, I love trying stuff. Like, so, y'all. Y'all got anything y'all want me to try. Y'all, like, you know, obviously I need to read up on it first. I ain't just going to try anything y'all just send me now. Um, but, yeah, anything y'all want me to try, you know, your girl is down to try it. Um, yeah, so comment below stuff you want me to try. Um, something you're not too sure about, but they got good reviews. I'm always down to do that. As long as it don't, like, obviously mess with what I got going on. Like, obviously I'm not going to sit here and try, like, um uh, these burger patties or something like that i don't know something random but um but yeah so yeah y'all if y'all have anything y'all want to try for real like i'm down i'm down i'm down down um but anyways y'all <laughs> i'm about to uh clean this up 
and probably eat a couple more peaches and it's a wrap for me uh for tonight i'm really not doing it tonight because tomorrow i have to clean and i have to do like so much other stuff y'all and yeah we back into this y'all and oh i forgot to tell y'all so we are going somewhere for july 4th i am not telling you guys yet but um best believe i will vlog there i promise <laughs> I know I didn't vlog in Tampa, but come on now, y'all. I'm moving down there. I'm moving down there. So y'all about to see Tampa, for real, for real. So, but anywhere I go, like, obviously, like, we know we went to Puerto Rico or whatever. I vlogged a little bit for y'all. And then also vlogged a little bit for the people in the Meg. Uh, but I am going to wherever we go for the 4th of July, y'all. I'm a, I ain't telling y'all just yet. But best believe y'all will get a video of what is going down for the fourth yes um what yes <laughs> anyways y'all it is your girl lola j and i will see you when i see you